If China invades Taiwan, would you send American troops to defend it? Well, the reason they're doing it now is they're not going to do it afterwards, okay? So, it's, you know, so they're doing it now. They want to do it China. Look, I had a, I had a very... I had a very good relationship with President Xi and a very good relationship with Putin and a very good relationship with Kim Jong-un, who is a nuclear force that you won't even believe. Can you say yes or no, whether you have talked to Vladimir Putin since you stopped being president? Well, I don't comment on that, but I will tell you that if I did, it's a smart thing. If I'm friendly with people, if I have a relationship with people, that's a good thing, not a bad thing in terms of a country. If you look at the events of January the 6th, 2021, it showed to many people America's democracy was unruly and violent. Only three weeks to go to the election. Will you commit now to respecting and encouraging a peaceful transfer of power? Well, you had a peaceful transfer of power. You had a peaceful transfer of power. You had a peaceful... Will... Come on, great, close jump. You had, you, a peace... you, had a peace... to... you had a peaceful transfer of power compared with Venezuela, but it was by far the most, the worst no. transfer of power for a long time. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate that because... This is the, you know, what they like to do. This is what they like to do. Uh, I th and, question, and, you know, it's very question, interesting. The question, question for President Trump is, would you respect yeah. the decision? When I found out about this interview, I did a little check. He's a man that has not been a big Trump fan over the years. So I had a choice. Do I do this interview or not? I'm glad I did it. But do I do this interview or do I disappoint a lot of people? Because I know a lot of people in the audience. But his view is very different than mine. Let, let me just say... March, it, it, we had a term, peacefully and patriotically. These were people. If you think an election is crooked, and I do, 100%, if you think the day it comes when you can't protest, you take a look at the Democrats. They protested 2016. They're still protesting it. And it was love and peace. And some people went to the Capitol. And a lot of strange things happened there. A lot of strange things with people being waved into the Capitol by police, with people screaming, go in, with that, that never got into trouble, you know? I don't want to mention names, but you know who they are. A lot of strange things happened. But you had a peaceful, very peaceful. I left. I left the morning that I was supposed to leave. I went to Florida. And you had a very peaceful transfer. This was not a... Uh, and, and I'll tell you what. Those people that did go dead, which was a tiny fraction of the people that went to Washington. I mean, you're talking about a, a, a very, very small, because you know, hundreds of thousands of people, and I don't know what you had, five, six, seven hundred people uh, go down to the Capitol. But those people, that was not, that was n not one of those people had a gun. Nobody was killed except for Ashley Babbitt. She was killed. She was killed. She was shot in the head by a policeman that was, had no, what he did was horrible. So, so I think we should be allowed to disagree on that. And obviously, you see by the reaction in this room, there's a lot of other people that disagree. To me, the most beautiful word in the dictionary is tariff. And it's my favorite word. It needs a public relations uh, firm to help it. But to me, it's the most beautiful word in the dictionary. 100, 200 percent on things you don't really like. You're also talking about 20, 10, 20%. I agree it's going to have a massive effect, positive effect. It's going to be a positive, not a negative. Well, just, just let, let me just, uh, no, no, let me tell you. I know how committed you are to this, and it must be hard for you to, you know, spend 25 years talking about tariffs as being negative and then have somebody explain to you that you're totally wrong. It'll have a negative, it will have...